Hey guys, what's up? I heard a little rumor. This city loves Supercross. They call him El Hombre. Dude, do you even speak Spanish? Hey, Weston, did you do your push-up today? That one's cold. That's cold. <laughs> That's cold in every way. That's cold-blooded. Supercross fans, are you ready? I got the phone call from J-Bone actually, you know, uh, he called me Monday and he was like, hey, you want to ride the bike, um, you know, we can give you two races and I was like, yeah, no problem because I've been working, you know, it's, uh, this is, I mean, as far as I can concern, I mean, this is the hardest I've worked since whenever I won the championship in 2016. 250 East Championship, Malcolm Stewart wins his first career title as he takes it here in Las Vegas. You know, you just, sometimes you just gotta go back to the books and uh, you know, you realize that, you know, you need to put the work in. Every time you throw your leg on a dirt bike, you know, there's a purpose. You know, we're out here trying to better ourselves, you know, we're all trying to go to this, you know, next step. So, um, for me, I can't be, like I said, I can't be more thankful that JDR actually stepped in and gave me an opportunity because nobody else is going to. And there is Malcolm Stewart on the 27. Great to see him back in the starting gate, filling in for Justin Bogle, who's injured and recovering. All right, man, have fun. You can do it. Malcolm Stewart on the number 27. Well, Stewart just blew past Buscan on that first long set of whoops, and then Buscan got a little more aggressive and took the position back. I'm just gonna go out here and do what I'm supposed to do, and uh, I can't control anything else. The only thing I control is just going out there racing. The guy who can adapt and find something new mid-race, that's the guy who will be successful in these main events, especially in the later stages. There goes the 32nd board. Round two, ready to go. Bumping and banging, Cooper Webb is off the track. Is that Porsche out front? It is, but not for long. There goes Roxon by in the 94. Here's Malcolm Stewart and his return to the series, and he's running in 12th right now. Oh, it's hard to step on a different bike and just join the join the championship like this, but Malcolm's a great talent, had that 250 championship, and look for good things out of him. You know, what people don't understand, it's, it's a lot. It's more than just throwing your leg over a dirt bike. If that was the case, then everybody would be doing it, right? You know, so there's a reason why, we, you know, we're professionals. If anything, this is only going to help me out. I mean, I can't thank JGR enough for, you know, giving me the opportunity. And I've always wanted to ride that new Suzuki anyways. It's, it's a good bike, you know, you can't, you can't deny it. And honestly, it's just a matter of having fun. I'm going to go out there and do the best that I can do. And at the end of the day, that's it. I'm just trying to be a role model for the kids, something to get, you know, look up to. Well, you know, not having a factory ride doesn't mean that, you know, your career is over, you know, and I'm proving that. 